Hello, hello everybody, and welcome back to more Digimon Digital Card Game, It's or Card Battle. It's me, Cooper, and we're going to be moving on to Sky City. We defeated the Pyramid City pretty easily, kind of easily. There were some, there were some touch and go moments. But we're going to be doing this one now. Whoa, what the hell is Player's Room? Player's Name, okay, so Cooper. Mid-level Tamer, nice. Hobby Collector. Game completion 27, car collection 30, digi part stock 14. Combat battles 39 wins, 4 losses. Two player battles, can't do it. Red deck 1, I don't have any friends that are willing to do it. Deck 2, no deck 3 yet. Um, partner cards, rank 17 Vmon and rank 1 Gatamon. Sorry about that, Gatamon. Eventually I might use you, I just need time. Let's go to the Battle Cafe of Sky City. This place seems fancy. Nice and fancy. Just the way I like it. So, let me see. We got... Uh, Kari. Kyrie. Okay. Oh, she doesn't want to talk. I'm Ganamon. Welcome to Sky City. Hi, I'm Cooper. You must be a pretty good card tamer to have come this far. I love playing digital card battle. Eh, yes, maybe you can do it. What, what are you talking about? Oh, nothing. Just talking to myself. I assume that you have seen the other cities on your way here. Did you notice anything strange? Yeah, a card tamer named Digimon Emperor was causing all kinds of trouble. But I took care of him, so don't worry. Also, some Digimon talked about him and some Dark Wave. But I have no idea who he is or what the Dark Wave is. Dark Wave? I see. Hey, what's going on? Well, my partner is a girl named Kari. Uh, she needs to, uh, Oh, she's been having these bad dreams lately. Kari possesses a strange ability. She's easily affected by evil energy. That's not a good ability. Kari can take the bad energy much longer. But this city's been quiet. Maybe the cities up ahead are in trouble. I prefer to investigate the matter myself, but I can't leave Kari here. I have to stay by her side. If you're going to the next city, will you find out what's going on for me? Sure, I could do that. Okay, that'd be great. So, first I gotta defeat you in your arena. Damn. Hi, I'm Kari. It's nice to meet you. I'm Cooper. Are you new here? Yep, that's right. Have you seen anything strange lately? Yeah, I've seen some stuff. Uh... Huh? Is he talking about Lilymon? Uh, no, I haven't seen her. I see. I just have a very bad feeling. I keep getting the sense of the huge tower and it's filled with dark shadows. Okay, well, this girl's crazy. Let's walk away. Yeah, I'll go check it out. Don't worry, Kari. And now that the battle arena is open, let's get in there and let's see if we can save the day with our casual Koopa powers, which I have none. <laughs> it's like I'm thinking about it. I have no superpowers, so honestly, I'm gonna have to do this with good old-fashioned uh, skill, Sk like a skill with a question mark. Oh, it's Wizard Mon! I freaking love Wizard Mon. My Digimon World, World DS Let's Play was saved thanks to my po the power of my Wizard Mon. Uh, there's no escape from my Magic Strike. Now is your chance to run. Okay, well this guy already seems crazy strong. His his stats were all around good. Um, I'm used to fighting people with at least one weakness, and this guy didn't seem to have any. Uh, I'm still gonna stick with the red deck because my Nya deck uh, doesn't have any real ultimates yet, just champions. I have one ultimate, but that's not really worth it. So let's see what Wizardmon can do against us. Obviously, I'm a little bit intimidated, but luckily I'm not going first. Sukaimon, what is that in his hand? He's not gonna throw anything away, that's uncommon. Let me find out why. Own it to HP becomes 10, its own attack power is doubled. Uh, discard all cards in own hand, then just draw two cards. If a low, if own level is lower than opponent, okay. Well, if I just go with Gaburimon, then this will work out in my favor. And then I don't want to throw you a rate of rack of DP, but I'm going to. I know, I know, folks. It's like Cooper, you just killed yourself. It's like guys, I know I killed myself. It's fine. It's fine. It's not about that. It's about winning. So I can go for any attack, and it technically be safe worst thing they can do is double their attack power and like even at that he wouldn't kill me so I'm gonna go with a good old-fashioned Gaburi strike and then all right so you're actually gonna draw two cards huh he's gonna try and draw which means he's not gonna do any damage to me this turn so I might as well heal myself get as much HP as possible that way I can survive whatever he's trying to do Oh, you got a blue ultimate. Okay, that's blue Marimon. Oh, this battle arena's tight. We're in the air. We're in like a sky bubble. I feel like we're on Kami's lookout. Alright, let's see how you do. Gaburi Strike. Yeah, I love this animation. 
technically that wouldn't be a strike since I actually hit you with the ball itself. And you went for your strongest attack, but your strongest... Sukaimon's not really a big hitter. Not gonna lie. So, that's fine. Your strongest attack doesn't mean much. Ooh, Snow Agumon. I'm a big fan. Big fan of Snow Agumon. Opponents, X attack power to zero. Okay, so all that's what these monsters like to do. But I, I literally, if I use Gaburi Strike again, I win. And even if he had the strongest attack in the world, it wouldn't stop me. So, here we go. I'm going for game. Yikes. Okay, he's trying to top deck something. Specialty changed. What, what do you mean? I'm a dark monster now? What the... I can't evolve if I'm dark. No! I use so many healing stuff since... Oh, no! Oh, crap. Do I have anything that changes me back to fire? Fluffy attack. I have never felt countered like this. I feel countered. I got outplayed. Literally can't evolve now. My plan was to evolve this turn and have a huge advantage on my opponent, but that's been ruined because now I'm a dark type. And you know I got that new evolution card. Uh, it turns out it'll let me evolve no matter what type I'm in, but it makes me... I need to have 20 more DP than normal. Oh, I wouldn't have made it anyway. <laughs> I'm looking at my hand. I wouldn't have evolved anyway, so who cares? Um, Mucho Mom, we're going to use you to rack up DP. I hope you're cool with that. Um, technically, I wouldn't evolve if I did this, and I want to keep my speed evolution for later. Plus, if own specialty is fire, own attack power is doubled. I'm ruined. I can't even... Oh, whoops. Uh, yes, I want to do that. And then... We're good. I'm assuming I'm fighting a Snow Agumon next. No, Shamamon, out of the blue. So it's Gaburimon versus Shamamon. Funny enough, that's a pretty common sight. Weirdly enough, you can't kill me. So I can just go straight up for a circle attack and it won't matter what you do. Um, I do need to get some cards out of my hand though. I would love for this to pull off, but I'm assuming he's going to go for his jamming effect. Let's find out. Misfire, okay, good. I'm going to heal 700 HP. Maybe I'll just win this fight with my rookie. Oh, was that a big misfire by him? Or did he actually go for an X attack? So, Shamamon versus Gaburimon. Let's do this. The Gaburi brothers back. Actually, no. My Gaburi brothers, I had a snow Gaburimon. But either way. Oh, so he did buff his X attack. So, that ended up being good for him. He got 300 damage on me. And I'm going to do 300 right back. As long as I don't let him evolve, I'm good. And the fact that he drew two water monsters kind of gave me a big advantage. So even if I can't evolve, I'm just I'm just going to win with a Gaburimon then. It's like, screw it, I'll make this work. And honestly, I will just make this work. Um, yeah, this is fine. I'm cool with this hand. Uh, let's go ahead and throw you away for DP. And then, obviously, I can't evolve, so... We'll just go ahead and fight you, for real. I can use my triangle attack since it's my safest attack. The Gaburi Strike again. I want to use the other moves and check them out, but I can't without getting countered. Another top deck? What are you going to do to me now? Ah, another top deck. Alright, no hurt in just trying to top deck my own card. Or no, no, nothing wrong with that. Another discard card. And I buffed myself, so no matter what, you're dead. I didn't need the buff, but I'm glad I did it. Just to guarantee that I'm not dealing with you. If I win this entire, like, gauntlet... If I win this first fight with just Gaburimon, that's going to be the most, like, amazing thing I've pulled off in this series. Because this area seemed like it was going to be tough. It's the final area of this second, uh... Second level? Second world? Second city. Second city. Alright. Ooh, he's got Sorcerer Mon. That's so cool. And what are those two cards in your hand? Opponent discards four top cards from online deck. That does not matter. So now I it, I can do a different move if I wanted to. I'm going to use Gaburi Mon just because I've been tired of using the same move. Um, like I said, I'm probably just going to win with this guy. So I'm going to go ahead and try to top deck again. And he's trying to discard. What, you're going to try and make me run out of cards? Jamming support. Okay. 
So, it would have not mattered anyway. You jammed my guy. Who cares? Like I said, I'm going to win this entire thing with a Gaburimon. None of this matters. Plus, this is one of the weakest moves you could have done to me. I still have 600 HP left, so unless he evolves, I won. Gabur oh, he can't because it's my turn next. I win. I defeated this opponent with just Gaburimon. There's no way he survives unless he draws a healing card. If he draws a healing, a healing card, then that's the one way he can beat me. Hey, what's up, Meteormon? I'm not going to be able to use you, sadly. Well, I mean, maybe I'll get to use you. I just don't have a reason to. See ya. Um, nah, we're good. We already won. Oh, wait, sorry. We already won. We're good. I'll use... Honestly, I can't use... I, I can use Gaburi Rush, but since he has so many cards that stop X attacks, I'm just going to go for the safe Gaburi Strike and end this duel. And I will probably heal myself just in case he gets, like, a buffing card. Well, no, nope, that's a guaranteed win. I don't need to heal myself at all. GG, bro. GG. Making me lose a lot of cards? I could care less. My new and, new and improved Dark Gaburimon has won me the first fight. Single-handedly. Never needed to evolve. He was perfect the way he was. 300 attack on all stats makes him really good if you can heal him. Because his HP is the one downside. <laughs> he is the stronger brother. I love the little twirl he does into a backflip. Freaking Gaburimon, man. I love these game creators. These guys put some time and effort into the Digimon and their animations. We got a perfect victory. Only using a rookie. No evolution necessary. No Digivolve win. No discard win. No loss win. Big experience points. We got to level up. All attack powers plus 50. Holy crap. That's not bad. Ooh, we got some new water Digimon like Gabumon and Autobomon. And we got Solarmon, but I, I could care less about Solarmon. I'm not really a Solarmon guy. I don't know what you guys at home are. Maybe you like them, maybe you don't, but I'm not one of them. Wow, I'm impressed you defeated my Magic Strike. You got some amazing moves, but the master of this arena is really strong. You better watch out. Alright, I'll do my best. It's time for Aero Vidramon. Whoa, that's an ultimate level Digimon. I'm Aero Vidramon. I'm your second opponent. I'm pretty wild. You'll better watch out. Yeah, dude, you are strong. Okay, this might be an interesting fight. So, if you remember, we fought Vimon way back when. We fought Vidramon way back when. And Vidramon beat us. And Vimon beat us. So, does that mean this guy's going to beat us? Oh, God. I just got to hope for the best. You know what? If he's using a grass deck, then my Tyranimon is strong against him. So, I just got to hope I draw Tyranimon. Interesting. What is this guy? Alright, yeah, Palmon. He's got Leomon. Ooh. Ooh, okay, he couldn't evolve. Thank God Leomon costs a lot to evolve. Because that could have gone horrible. Bone level is lower than opponent's boost attack power by 500. So if I evolve immediately, I'm killing myself. That's basically what that means. However, if I evolve immediately, I can kill him so he doesn't get that. If bone level is below opponent... Okay, so I need to stay at the same level as, as them. It's the only way. And I just need to win like that. Yeah, as long as I keep my level at the same level as them, no evolution, no nothing, I'll be fine. Oh, this card could have changed me back to a fire type. Funny enough. Get out of here. Um, we're going to go ahead and go for the Tropical Beak, and we're going to hope it's enough to win. I'll just buff myself real quick. Ah, if that card lets you go first or counters my circle attack, I'm going to be pissed. Let's find out. Whoa. Whoa, that was a top deck. That thing gave you 400 attack on everything. I, my Moochamon would be dead right now if I wasn't going first. Literally the, literally, the only reason why I'm winning this is because I went first. Or technically because I went second. <laughs> or I drew second. Yikes. I never even seen a card that will buff all your stats by 400. I don't know what it does. I don't know why he was allowed to. But I need to learn about that card. Alright, you better draw a rookie. No rookie, you gotta discard. Okay, you got an Elecmon this time. But no champions, luckily. And there's that card again. Alright, if own level is R, boost on attack fire by 400. So I'm dead. I, I died. 
I died right now. The best I could do is do a fast attack and uh, get as much damage off as possible. Because that guy boosts himself by that much damage, I lose. So yeah, Bergeron, thank god I got you. Um, this guy has some pretty good rookie cards. That Electabon's horrifying to me. Luckily, I'm going to get one more Tropical Beak off before I die. I gotta get lucky with a top deck, though. I need to get a rookie that's pretty decent. How much damage did I do to this guy? I need a rookie that can do 330 damage. Honestly, that's most of my rookies, if I am allowed to use my circle. Oh, you did a backflip! Oh, that's so cute. I love backflips. Ah, oh, it's Flipsy all over again. I miss my Elecmon from back in my Digimon World Let's Play. He used to do backflips too. Oh, man. Good times. All right, I drew three Biomons, which basically means I'm fine, because Biomon has 350 attack, and my opponent has, if own level is ultimate, own attack power is double. That's crazy. That's way overkill. Burrymon, you're useless to me now, but thank you for winning me that fight last time. Let's just go for a Spiral Twister. And, uh, if he top decks, I'm gonna be horrified, but I'm sure I'll be fine. I don't need to use a Biomon in my hand, technically, so I'm probably just gonna chill and not do anything. Misfire, thank god. I don't know what that black ball is, but thank god it misfired. Ooh, could have been bad. Now, what I need to do is I need to get a champion level Digimon. Uh, so that I can evolve. My opponent is out of cards. They had to discard. That stopped me from... Uh, or that, that countered me if I'm a champion. And he's a rookie. So, yeah. Should be fine. Let's see what else you got. No champion still. I got really lucky. Again, though, what does Elecmon do? If opponent's specialty is water... Yeah, not that. No. If own level is lower, switch HP with opponent. All of that is actually okay with me. This is perfect. And you don't counter my circle attack, so that's beautiful. I get to go all out on you. Granted, your HP is too high. I can't kill you. Even with Biomon. But I'm going to use Biomon because it's just a safe amount of damage, guaranteed. Unless that card counters me. Nope, Misfire. He oh, there's his champion that he's been waiting for. There's Vidramon. He just couldn't draw it in time. What an unlucky guy. Alright, Salomon. Good luck against my Biomon. Puppy Howling is adorable. Adorable. Now, granted, I've taken too much damage. I need to evolve now. So, best case scenario, I draw a champion card. Even though... Uh, damn it, no, he counters champ. No, no. He'll switch HPs with me if I do that. So, I might as well just go for game. Yeah, if I evolve, it's actually a misplay. So, let's throw you away. Cancel that. And then, with what we have now, if I just go for X to guarantee that I get the first attack, unless he heals. Let me see. If I just go for an X attack and buff it with Biomon, I'm fine. Yeah, that's fine. I'll go with Turbo Pecker. And then I'm gonna buff it with my Biomon, guaranteeing me the win. The only thing he could do is top deck, and I'm assuming he's given up. Counter is set. You can't counter an X attack, buddy. At least your Digimon can't. I think I won, everybody. You were way easier than the last guy. Or not. No, no, never mind. You were hard. Gaburimon won me the entire fights. So, you were way easier than Vidramon, is what I'm trying to say. And Turbo Pecker. Oh, the puppy that evolves into a cat for some reason. Yeah, look at you, Biomon. You're so happy. Your happiness makes me happy. And just like that, I'm looking real good. The Slayer deck couldn't do it. I got a lot of experience from that fight. I got no Digivolves again. It's freaking amazing. I got an Ultimate Andromon. I have a Dark Ultimate now. Own HP is half boost on attack by 400. HP of 1700. That might be the highest HP I've seen so far. Auroramon, own attack becomes the HHP, own attack powers have, that's fine. Bloom Aramon, oh, okay. I'm a fan. I'm a big fan of this hand. These cards I'm starting to draw, they're much better. 
Darn, I went too easy on you. I didn't think I'd lose. You know what you should do? You should relax more. Okay, I'll try to enjoy myself. While I'm fighting the boss of this arena, Gatamon. Low defense, high attack, very high digivolve. Yep, this is going to be tough. Okay, I'll 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 go I'll go to Wise Man Tower and fix your all your problems. But I'm gonna have to defeat you to do it. So this is gonna be one of our hardest fights yet. Gatamon, let's do this. Funny enough, I have a Gatamon, I have a Gatamon deck, but it's a very bad idea to use Gatamon on Gatamon since my Gatamon deck has like no ultimates, barely any champions. I just don't have a lot. Cat attack deck versus red deck. I'll get to see what you want to do first, because I'm going second. Alright, let's see what they got. They drew Dramojimon, but they have to discard it to try and build up power. So I need a high son of a bitch. That was an unlucky draw if I've ever seen one. I'm going to throw away two attack power chips and one of my healing chips. All right, this is a little bit better. Now, technically, I still lose. Not even joking. So I'm going to have to evolve immediately in order to not lose. So I'm going to summon Muchomon. I'm going to get rid of Gaburimon. I'm going to evolve immediately into Dark Flareismon, which I did not want to do. Let it be known. I didn't want to do this, but I'm forced to. Because if I don't, their attack will be too high and I die. So, best I can do is a Blaze Buster. They can counter my triangle moves, so for once I can't use triangle. I can't trip. Ooh, top decking. Okay, if we're top decking instead of using our buffing card, then fine. I'll top deck too. Ooh, big top deck. You die. You die, sir! <laughs> I actually beat them. And if they don't draw any rookies, I can make them discard their power-up cards, which would make me very happy. What a top deck, man. What a top deck. And luckily, they did not get a top deck. So, instant kill, Blaze Buster. Don't even get to see your attack. Front flip, fireball, basically. The creators of this game love front and back flips. There we go. And there goes the pupper. Oh, they did. I was right. Okay. They didn't draw any champions. Lucky me. Oh, my video's done. That's a tournament video that you guys haven't seen yet. All right. Puppy Howling. Again, we're in the same boat. I'm not water. This counters X. So my best attack is to go for circle. And I have a 0% chance of dying. So I don't need to waste my Bergeron in my hand. Plus, I could top deck for a lucky power boost. So, why not? I did not go for an X attack. I don't know why you thought I would. Did you at least try to counter? Oh, I got a healing card! And you tried to counter me. Wow. So, going for X or triangle was death there. But luckily, I went for circle. So, this puppy's going to take most of uh, their, you know, most of their da damage. Sorry, most of their HP is damage. They're going to lose. Blaze Buster. They only got 50 HP left, and I'm going first next turn, which is perfect. Absolutely perfect. The best draw I could get is a Speed Evolution and Master Tyrannomon. Nope, I got a bunch of good cards, but not good in this situation. So, Tyrannomon, goodbye. And I'll just chill. And I can do any attack, basically, except Triangle, and I'll win. So, I think I'll do a Circle Attack, as always, since it's gotten me this far. Gatamon's going with the top deck. I'm going first anyway. I feel like there's no chance of survival. So there's no reason to gamble. We're good. I'm going first anyway. I was horrified when I saw the 500 point buff. Don't get me wrong. But I'm going first, so it doesn't matter. And thanks to them doing that, they're not going to draw Leomon next turn. So they can't evolve into Leomon. Because uh, they already have a rookie in their hand, so I'm assuming they're going to summon a Lekmon, and then if they draw a champion, it's basically a guarantee they're going to evolve. And then we're going to get our first real fight. But, Flareismon already got healed, so my HP bar is looking real nice. So nice, in fact, that I'm going to be just fine. Alright, they still drew a Leomon either way. Alright, Leomon's going to be our first real opponent in this fight. He has no counters, he's just damage, but what does Dramojimon do? Boost no attack power by 200. He can't kill me, my HP's too high. 
So what I can do is I can go for a Blaze Buster again. There's no counter in my circle attack. And I can just go maximum damage with Biomon. It's guaranteed max damage. And he can go maximum with Dramojmon if he wanted to. Okay. So we're just trying to kill each other. It's a, it's a fist fight. We're going to punch each other until the other one falls over and dies. But I punch a little harder. And thanks to that heal I got earlier, I'm going to uh, do even more. I mean, I'm going to take it even better. Leomon is a really cool Digimon, don't get me wrong. And he has really cool evolutions. Lion Sword! And effects in this game are really cool. But, even with an attack buff, he couldn't do half my health, whereas my attack buff did most of his health. And I go first next turn, so I'm guaranteed to win this fight. Perfect victory with Flareismon, or if I really need to, I can evolve. And I got Master Tyranimon, but... I don't think I have enough to evolve. He costs 50. He costs 50 to evolve. So even if I try to rack up DP like this, it won't matter. Let's just go for game. I'm going to use my circle attack as always. Even though I'm going first, I am going to use uh, bird. Well, you know what? If he's going to lucky top deck, I'll lucky top deck. Oh, no, I'm, I'm going to double my power. He's going for broke. I am too, but since I go first, you lose. He used everything. That top deck is giving him enough power to kill me. It's just it came too late. It was one turn too late for Leomon. Blaze Buster. Done. The scary thing is his attack was still stronger than mine, even though I doubled it. So he would have destroyed me easily. And that's it. We perfect victory against Gatamon. The cat deck sucked. All circle attack win. I never pressed anything other than circle that entire fight. Vimon loves it. He's like, ah, that was good. Bomber Nanimon. Bergermon again. I love me a Bergermon. Those are good. Gomamon. Uh, Lotus attack triangle power. You know what? That could be bad. I mean, that could be good. That's not too bad. So, Gatamon, you going to give me a pass to the next city? I would like to go to the next city. Uh, just as I thought, I can leave this mission to you. I know I'm asking a lot, but please do this for me. Travel safe. And I got the pass road to the steep road. And a green pack. Yay, I can use green packs. Okay, Kunamon. Yes, Vegemon. I'll take it. Ninjamon, amazing. Ooh, Ninjamon's great. Kunamon is actually good. Okay, my green deck is almost usable. Whoa, Gigadramon, what's that? Oh, he's a big boy. He's got no effect, though. Ah, oh, damn. But his X has 550. His 900 is circle. Oh, my God. So he's just a straight-up beef. He's just beef. And Gigadramon's a cool card, so don't get me wrong. I love Gigadramon, but damn. Having no special effect, though, kind of makes him kind of bad. I don't know if I want him. In the end, though, that's great, guys. Thank you all for watching this episode. I'm happy I got a good green pack. I'm happy I got Gigadramon. Uh, if you're enjoying the series, please remember to like and subscribe, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye